I have just started pumping the water on my new aquaponics Dutch bucket system. I've got 48 Dutch buckets over here. Over here, I've got three beds. These are 15 gallon barrels cut in half, so they're about seven and a half gallons each. This is my seedling starter floating on top of the water and filling these trays with a little bit of water. The water is wicked up by the rock wool. And then next to it I have a couple of uh, fill and drain tanks. The water is kind of brown right now because I've put some liquid seaweed Nazi crop in the water and and take a few days to clear up, hopefully. <laughs> a sump tank, about 125 gallons. In the sump tank, I've got a 1,000 gallon per hour water pump, pumping water up about six feet through a three quarter inch pipe. Water comes over to the fish tank. And I've got an 8 watt air pump pumping air into the fish tank. I'll eventually take one of these air lines and put it into my water clarifier. Over on the left, the water drains out from the surface through a 1 inch pipe into the 15 gallon auto siphon tank, and on the right, the water drains out a one inch pipe. Now this pipe comes up from the bottom of the tank, and it sucks the solids from the bottom of the tank and dumps the water out over here on the right into the swirl filter, water clarifier, and then it goes over to the next water clarifier five gallon water bottle and it has four gallons of uh, bio marble balls. And that four gallons of bio marble balls gives me 50 square feet of biofiltration. So the tank is filled and it's draining. Water comes out of the 15 gallon tank and goes into a 3 inch pipe that's 8 feet long. It charges this 8 foot pipe with about 4 gallons of water. And then the water drains through the quarter inch hoses into. 55 gallon half barrel drum. And at the bottom of the drum, I cut a slot along the bottom for the water to drain out, and I put some uh, plastic filter material for the water to drain through. Underneath, the water drains into a rain gutter that runs all along the bottom of the barrel. And from the ring gutter, it drains into a one and a half inch pipe. A one and a half inch pipe goes back to the sump tank. I've got a rain gutter under each barrel. So, in the next couple of months, I'm going to cycle this system and start growing some lettuce, and uh, I actually could have doubled the size of this system. There's one 15 gallon tank over here that's draining into this entire bed and filling these 48 pots. 
I could have put another one of those barrels on the right side and had another 48 pot. But the greenhouse is not big enough. It's only a 12 by 14 greenhouse. So, I'll have to check back for updates. See how the system is going. Thanks for looking.